Happy Wednesday, this is Denton County Weather for the latest two and a half minute forecast. Temperatures out there this morning, it's looking like a fantastic morning. Most of us are sitting in the 50s right now, even some upper 40s back off to the north, uh, just northwest of uh, Gainesville. So it is a pretty chilly morning for most of us. Um, some lower 60s here in the interior metroplex, but it is definitely feeling like a chilly morning here in the suburbs. Make sure you have a fleece jacket just in case, but it will warm up this afternoon, so be, don't be too concerned. It's not winter. It's obviously only the beginning of fall. Uh, temperatures by lunchtime, most of us will only be in the mid 70s, maybe a few upper 70s, again in the interior portions of the metroplex. By about 3-4 o'clock, I don't even think a lot of us will even hit 80, but a few of us will in the interior metroplex. I'm talking about like Denton County, uh, Dallas County, Tarrant County, and Collin County. Those areas will probably at least get into the lower 80s, but mostly some upper 70s out towards the north and also to the east. Um, some lower 80s as well back down to the south. So it will be definitely a chilly day out there <laughs> for some of us. So I uh, definitely have a fleece jacket just in case. Looking at the dew points, I did want to bring this up. We're not going to see any showers or storms today, but I want to bring up the dew points. You can see 2, 3 o'clock dew points are going to be in the 30s today. So this is the driest day that we've seen in quite some time. So um, obviously be prepared for that. It will not feel anywhere close to summer. Uh, beginning of fall is looking fantastic so far. So I uh, definitely enjoy the weather while it lasts and I don't see any summer type forecasts coming up here in the next 7 to 10 days. Alright, quick look at the tropics and we'll get to the 7 day forecast. Uh, we have Tropical Depression Peter. This one's going to be moving off to the north uh, toward Bermuda. N it doesn't look like it'll re-strengthen into a storm, but this one has impacted areas like Puerto Rico and the Lesser Antilles very minorly. So at least this was not a big uh, storm there. Here's uh, the remnants, basically, of Audette. It still has 50-mile-per-hour winds, but this is going to have a chance of redeveloping. Over the next five days, it doesn't really have much of a direction. It's going to be kind of stationary, so we'll have to wait and see what happens there. Also, Tropical Storm Rose. This one will be heading off to the north and northeast. We also have an area development that will likely come toward at least the Lesser Antilles. Um, has about a 90% chance of developing over the next five days, and you can see the computer models are generally bringing this toward the Lesser Antilles, and I'm really talking about anywhere right in here, uh, anywhere from St. Lucia northwards. That would probably be the best area they would go. Um, it looks like it has a very similar track though uh, to what we've seen with Peter so far so I'll have to watch out for that one and see what happens there quick look at your 7 day forecast obviously today most of us will just barely touch 80 degrees going to tomorrow and Friday temperatures will steadily warm back up closer to the 90s I'm not anticipating anything past 90 degrees but some lower 90s maybe for Saturday and Sunday will be possible going to next week it looks like we have some rain chances returning by Tuesday and that could also bring some thunderstorms this forecast is brought to you by DFW or DFW Riving Pro <laughs>